safest and cheapest ultimate team coins anywhere check out rockbottomcoins.com and use code zirk at checkout for a 10 percent discount on your order the whole thing wobbing. What is going on guys? It is Xerxes coming today with another YouTube video and today we have the limited time signature series cards in packs. Before we get into that, I do want to show you guys the solo challenges. I was up until about 3 a.m. doing all these so it took me about I think four hours to finish all these solo challenges. Now it's really not that hard aside from the full games and then the last solo challenge you actually have to do i think it was uh 100 rushing yards 225 passing yards score 28 points hold your opponent to less than i think it was 200 passing yards 100 rushing and you can't allow them to score 14 points i think that's all you had to do but it was five minute quarters so you can easily get the yards the hardest thing is just trying to stop them but if you have a pretty decent team you definitely should be able to do that but in my opinion guys these solo challenges are really really not that hard i mean even the full game solos they're really like pro difficulty this one's all pro that one's not even a full game this is a full game that's all pro uh this as well looks to be were these uh, i don't know if both of these were full games that's kind of weird i don't remember playing back-to-back -back full games but besides the point these solo challenges are definitely worth doing if you guys are even nearly interested in the draft promo as you guys can see you get a free 95 plus now uh as you guys already know with the draft promo you start off with 99s, go all the way down to probably like 92, and that'll probably be like the second round players. So for the first round players, I'm going to guess it's going to be 99 to 93 overall, maybe 94 hopefully. But as you guys can see, I was able to get myself, we can actually double check and see exactly how many NFL draft tokens I have. 17 of the NFL draft badges from playing the solo challenges. Also have future star tokens. I actually think that you only get 15. I think I got two more somehow, some other way. But we also have a future star token for completing these solo challenges. So when that set does drop, which it will, I believe, tonight uh, after the draft sometime. I believe it's going to be like all the way after the draft. I will probably make a video with that coming out. Depending if it's like super late, if it's like midnight or something, maybe I'll just save it for the morning, for Friday morning. And you guys will have that as well as my boss battle 99 overall pack opening. Finally going to be able to get that as well. So definitely got a lot in store today and a lot in store tomorrow. Also today, I'm going to be having my weekend league rewards probably coming out pretty soon right after this video and then of course later today we'll have more draft information so if you guys aren't already subscribed and you don't have the notification bell on subscribe and turn that notification bell on so you guys get notified whenever i make those videos you definitely do not want to miss out let me actually back out real quick just to make sure that the signature cards are in these packs but you definitely do not want to miss out on the draft promo and believe me i will definitely make some uh different like a ton of different videos honestly might make like three more videos after that because on the little month tip i actually quick sold it but i'm going to tell you guys this real quick before i come to packs that there's going to be blitz type pack programs or like kind of promos so if you guys weren't around for the blitz promo which was around black friday time basically you're just gonna have to be on and just see it so if you go to exclusive packs, there might be a pack right here, say, okay, so let's let's see what's in the store. So NF replay pack is 600 points. Most likely they're not going to do this. They'll probably do ultimate legend fantasy packs, and they might even hit us with that. Oh, I can't think of the name of it, but it was like a, a fire pack. And basically in the top of, I think you can get it for being like top uh, 10 or top 20 for the monthly rewards i don't remember what it is exactly i know it's top 100 i think for weekly like monthly rewards if you're in that then you get this pack and i don't remember what it's called please leave a comment down below if you know what i'm talking about but it has like a, a guaranteed ultimate legend player and like a guaranteed two other cards and it's a fantasy pack but it only has three cards but the cards are absolutely amazing now they might drop something like that in the store and it might cost you 20 dollars. definitely will be worth that and i'm definitely going to buy those up if they do pop up in the store as you guys can see i definitely did stock up on points prepared for this and also maybe they do like ultimate legend uh packs which usually go for 20 dollars. they might have them up for 10 or 15 
some just a little bit discounted and then of course i think they even said something on the mutt tip about special edition players so i'm super excited for this hopefully we do get like some limited time cards in packs just swimming around uh let's go ahead and open up i'm either gonna do a nfl replay pack i'm saving that points basically for later because i really want to see exactly what we're gonna get or you might be able to get a four go player pack bundle i'm gonna do the four bundle and buy that with points so i'm 9200 ready for later definitely excited and hopefully we get some limited time cards that i can open packs for and also maybe just rip a couple bundles but let's go ahead and get into these packs and see what we're gonna pull hopefully pull marcus Mariotto. Mariotto. Mariota, that card is going to be going for a ton of coins, I gotta say. He's a 98 overall. The card itself really doesn't look like anything spectacular, but, ooh, 82 Christian McCaffrey, okay. Uh, 87 speed, 90 XL. Dang, they really did not juice him at the beginning of the year. Last card in the set, or last card in the pack. Come on. And unfortunately, did not pull anything too good. But we can actually see how much that Christian McCaffrey's going for. And then we'll go ahead and check out the Ox Mugs. See if we can find these new limited time cards. Oliver Vernon and Marcus Mariota. No, why do I keep saying Mariota? Mariota. That card is definitely going to be pretty expensive. And I got to say, with the draft promo coming out, I'm thinking about getting rid of Breeze. If one of the draft qbs is pretty good now we already know that there's probably going to be like four qbs taken maybe in the top 10 so the odds of one of those qbs being pretty decent is probably 100 so especially the number one overall pick i expect him to be like a qb obviously but i expect him to be like absolutely goonish so we'll have to see what they do with the draft players but we have our signature series cards and we can see if mariotto is up and I keep seeing Mariotto. Mariotta, I don't know why I keep seeing that. And it doesn't look like Oliver Vernon or Mariotta is up. So I will be right back as soon as they are. So once again, as usual, these signature cards and also the NFL replay cards never seem to be up on the actual game until like an hour later. So I'm just going to go ahead and go over their stats on Mudhead. But as you guys can see with Marcus Mariotto, why do I keep saying that? Marcus Mariotta. Not really too sure why I keep saying Mariota, but as you guys can see, he does have the move the sticks cam and also toughness, 91 speed, 93 excel, 92 throw power, 93 short, 91 medium, 91 deep, 96 play action, also a 91 play, or 90, yeah, 96 throw on the run, dang, 91 play action with an 86 spin and an 86 juke move. Now, if you have tier 5 of move the sticks then he actually goes up to 90 spin 90 juke 97 throw short and 95 throw medium gotta say that card looks pretty dang good now if you're really big into scrambling qbs he also has energizers so i mean that's like perfect for scramblers i guess definitely a pretty good card i feel like he might be even better than vic in terms of a passer which I think he actually is. I'll have to look into that. Of course, he doesn't have the throw power or the actual gunslinger chem, unfortunately. Or, you know, after, you know, in terms of running, doesn't have the spinner Jukovic. But he definitely has some pretty good stats. One being right-handed if you don't like Vic being left-handed. And then Olive Vernon, for some reason, his card art is messed up on here. That is not his actual card art. That would be uh, quite interesting. But you guys can see, he has 86 speed with a 91 excel, 90 jump, 97 play rick, only an 88 strength though, but a 98 power move, 92 finesse, 96 block shed, 97 pursuit, 94 tackle, 90 hit power. The card is absolutely amazing. And then of course, a blanket coverage can boost his finesse move. And of course, with the reaction can boost his power move. So you can get up to, I think, 96 finesse. And of course, 99 power move. So definitely a pretty good card if you ask me overall. I think these signatures this week, pretty good. I actually really love this Mariotto. I just can't stop myself from saying Mariotto. Mariotta, I'm gonna force feed myself that name, I swear to God. But that is the signature cards for today. I'm going to be doing my weekly rewards right after this. And then we have the draft promo coming out later. Very sorry for messing up Mr. Marcus's name a million times in the video. But if you guys do enjoy the video, hit the like button, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys next time.